You know what's the thing? I never understood about some movies. Whenever the bad guys said the time bomb to go off in two minutes, then five minutes later, then it's all of a sudden 30 seconds. As in five minutes have gone by in real life, but in the movie, a minute and 30 seconds went by. Like, like you know, you know what dumb logic that is. And you know what's the thing I've never understood? Even in sci-fi movies, like let's say the bad guys set the bomb for, I don't know, one or two minutes because the bad guys want to give enough time for themselves to run out of an area before the bomb explodes or destroys the entire area. But what I never understood is that even in sci-fi movies, why can the bad guys use like a remote or whatever to remotely detonate the bomb so that they wouldn't have to use a timer because clearly the bad guys just give way too much time for the good guys to disarm the time bomb I mean do, do you guys know what stupid logic that is it's so I, I, I just think I don't even know what world I'm living in anymore okay here's a very dumb logic the killer is in the basement better go there yeah, sure. Sounds like a good idea. I mean, it sounds like you should grab a weapon or, I don't know, uh, grab a flashlight or call the police or anything. No, just go into the basement and everything will be okay. Movie logic. If you are in a movie in French, the Eiffel Tower will be visible in every shot. Okay. I've seen this meme before, and at first I thought, well, how would you know it's a French movie? But then I realized that the people who made the French movies would actually tell the audience it's a French movie, but yeah. I mean, I get that the French movies need to make it obvious that they're in French. It's not really necessary to have the Eiffel Tower in every shot. I mean, you know what I mean. Bad guys don't deserve a nose. Huh. That's very weird. You know, I always thought that Voldemort... Wait, is that his name? Voldemort? I always thought that he had a nose, but the nose was just very, very flat. This metal is impressive, but what is the paint made of? Oh. I was never really curious enough to think about what Captain America's shield's paint is made out of. Or the paint of the shield, or whatever. Hey, here's a crazy theory. Maybe the paint is made out of paint. Okay, yeah, sorry, no, that, that... That was a stupid thing that I just said just now, sorry. How baseball bats are used in movies. For playing baseball, hitting people, hitting zombies. Okay, I've never really seen a horror movie or a zombie movie. But I can agree 100% that there's like so many movies where the good guys literally use pretty much any weapon that they can find to whack the zombies. You know, it kind of makes sense to me. What helicopters do in action movies? Explode. You know what's pretty interesting? In most action movies, a helicopter would normally, you know, fly into a building or, I don't know, get hit by something and then the helicopter explodes. But what's interesting is that even when it lands safely, it just explodes. Guys, you know I'm right. Magic can regrow bones in arm overnight, still wears glasses. You know, I never really thought of that. Like, I never really thought of how, um, Harry Potter's magic can heal any damage to the body, but he still wears glasses. Okay, yeah, I guess it kind of makes sense. I don't know. I mean, sometimes it's better to not overthink with these movie stuff and to just enjoy them. But then again, why? Why do some of these movies have these weird things that happen that, that it, it just makes people curious about why the film writers or the film directors don't actually know what real logic is. Oh, and you guys know what? Here's this joke that's being used in lots of movies that it, it's, it's just an overused joke that I decided to make a meme about it. 
when there's a babysitter character in a movie. So, like, let's say that in a movie there's a babysitter. Nobody. Not a single person in the movie. Script writers. Let's make jokes about sitting on babies. Okay, let me put it more clearly. Literally every single movie where there's a babysitter, the people literally make jokes about sitting on babies. I mean, it, 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 it's such a weird, weird joke and it's so overused. It's, it's not even funny anymore. I remember when it was used in The Cat in the Hat and maybe a few other movies. Like, it's so overused. Anyways guys, that's pretty much it for this video. If you guys enjoyed this video, please give a like and it would be really kind of you if you subscribe to my channel. And please go check out my other videos. Alright, see ya.